The central installation of Future Forward is the Dynamic Visual Poetry Landscape System, or DeVeeples, a multi-user interactive creative tool based upon an original integration of voice recognition, virtual environment, and 3D computer imaging. Animate. The exquisite corpse shall drink the new wine. Next font. Next font. Next font. Animate. The landscape system also possesses an ever-expanding database of keyword images. Visitors are invited to explore the landscape, see speech become text become visual poem, and create their own kinetic 3D visual poetry on site. This one-of-a-kind installation was co-designed by Peter Oppenheimer and Michael Ricciardi. Poetry takes on many forms. Some of it is written, some of it is spoken. Some of it is beyond words. In this newest version of DeVeeples, we've added a greater degree of interactivity with the graphic elements and the words. We've expanded the quality of the speech recognition, and we've created a bunch of visual effects that allow the user to animate and uh, modify their poem. Serendipity would have it. that I would find myself at the ocean with an oceanographer. I look forward to using this in a performance context where a poet will be in front of an audience reciting their poem and their visual context of that poem will appear behind them spontaneously as it is spoken. Children have especially interesting experience with the Veeples. Their poetry is very spontaneous. They're very uh, eager to explore. They are very uh, computer literate, and so they step right into the Veeples and can use it very easily, and they're also very excited. The Internet is another uh, total an avenue for using the Veeples, and people will be able to do collective poems. People around the world will be able to contribute their poem into some collective poetry context. The Veeples allows one to change the form of text information. Web browsers are one forms of displaying this type of information. So I see a merging of the Veeples and browsers. So the browser now taking information off the web can display it not merely in the structure that was defined by the web creator, but by a poet or an artist who can now reform, reshape, and, and mold the web content. I think it would be fun to watch the news that way. One of our goals is to adapt the medium to the user rather than have the user adapt to the medium. In order to do this, we need to expand the sense of modalities that the system uses. Right now, we're using speech recognition so the poet can naturally talk to the system. The next step is to allow the poet to use gesture to manipulate the poem visually, moving the words and pictures around. And so by adding a gesture tracking system to the Veeples, we'll be able to expand in a very natural, intuitive way for the artist uh, their interaction with their visual poem. I'd like to see the Veeples escape from the confines of the computer screen and enter into our environment using virtual reality, immersive technology, caves, head-mounted displays, etc so that uh, rather than just watching it on a small screen, the poet can actually walk into the poem and have the poem surround the poet and the audience. More than anything else, Feature for Word is about exploring and expanding 
the creative possibilities of poetic expression.